ஓகே மேம் மேம் இல்ல இது பிளக் சொல்றாங்க வெல்கம் பண்ண மாதிரி பேச மாதிரி Good afternoon, here. I am Professor Jennifer, Department of B.Com, C.A. and A.N.F. from D.B. Chain College to deliver Chief Guest address here. Today, our Chief Guest, Dr. A.S. Madheshwaran, the Founder and Managing Director of the reputed Software Training and Development Company, United IT and CAD Division, and United Manufacture India, indeed a person of great virtue. He did his research work in the area of structural engineering civil. Currently, he is guiding many of the research scholars to come skill set in maintaining the training institute and creating opportunities to turn new businesses. Still, solutions has been one of his motives. So, we are so glad to have you for today's session, sir. Without any delay, I hand over the session to you, sir.
Hello. Yes, sir. Very clearly, sir. Acha, okay. Well and good. Well and good. Acha, okay. First of all, I thanks a lot for me giving this opportunity for me to give the session in this afternoon for you from United Group of Companies. So I am Dr. Madhusudan from United Research and Development Lab, Salem. So what we are doing in our company, we are majorly focusing upon. how to prepare the journals that is in high impact journals and also this is all the things we are guiding and we are doing development new technology based and emerging trends based applications we are using in our all branch of engineering and also in commerce or in all industry based applications all the things we are doing in our company so today my task is that target your research at high impact journal so in the title itself that you are giving a good opportunity to how to fix a target for each and every person to in their life cycle to achieve our goal we should fix on a target so within this age within this year within this day i want to complete this work like that in according to our we are come to our journal preparation so selecting selection of an, a journal is very very essential because before that selection of high impact journals what is the need of preparing a journals what is the need what is the applications what is the advantages to be there to preparing a journal and what it will be do for our life cycle how it will be more helpful for our future also these things we want to have and clear then we can move ahead before that the about the session the objective session what about the journals what about the classification the journals and types of journals to be there what about the impact factors of the journals to be there publications and indexing this is a task which is assigned to me in this today's session i am going to interact with you it is an interactive session it is on you can interact and we can have a share our experiences to you what are the things we have i have gathered for the past 20 years in the field of preparation of thesis and journals all those things okay well <coughs> before log into <coughs> session journal yeah about the research so what is the research what it will be do for what purpose we can go ahead for do a research first of all among 100 people There is a eighty percent of our people are looking for to do research and higher studies. What is their aim? Why we need to do the research? 
so after learning and subjects after learning and curriculum after learn, achieving a degree all of things what is your part in your life cycle life span to make a milestone in your life cycle that is the thing you are going to do and please search so you can split that word research re and search search for findings re already what is on the existing things will be there for example we can take our life studies which your friends will tell us that my moral will be of he my moral will be of abdul kalam so my aim is like to him so this is a thing what we we are going to rework research that we are going to do with help of applications research purpose it is a combining information find out by doing research your own ideas and existing thing what is the existing things will be there that you are going to remodify and you are going to by applying a new technology what is the current trend is there by giving a more information and a more idea to bring to me an best blooming flower that is a research you are did in our future so who are what the research is going to do they do should follow journal publications this is submission in between those things he is going to find out the locations sharing of data gaining of data data all the things will be get included the heads of the search he is a person who is going to find a new things by keeping that existing as a base and climbing as a new application that is something research is going to follow before begin you must select of your own interest own platform before enter into the college life cycle that you have a some ambition of life cycle what is that sir i want to become a best engineer or i want to become a best chartered accountant i want to become an an odd applications oriented e-commerce business person like that there is a lot of widening widening and things to be there so in which area we can do our research that is your major criteria that we are going to fix and we can work to achieve the output what is our expectation level that is the thing we are going to plan it first you can think once you are going to think there is a little bit confusion has been come but finally you can get a shaping of that particular thesis and output will be even some positive result you have generated after a long gap of working okay so this is the thing we are going to start with it before that first you can select the domain in which domain you are going to prefer if you are be blank so commerce department whether you are going to work with a financial division or an sharings lot of field that you have come across it first you can in which field you are be interested you should select your domain and you can find out the requirements for to develop your research and you can go ahead for select the topics and choices there is a multiple choices will be there the choices you can move ahead for which is a opt and best for your development of your researchers that you can select and you can move ahead so Before that, what is the domain? First of all, it is a field study of any applications. It may be of commerce or it may be of science, whatever it may be. General requirement terms function for any software program. There will be solve a problem in computer programming or a manual applications. That is a domain in engineering or an arts and science or whatever, whatever it may be. So it will find you your ideas and learn lot of things you have get it from the books through existing data that it, it will improve your skills and the knowledge of your last three year studies or five year studies or six year studies what you have learned lot of things that you are going to shape and you are going to submit on on future career down so this will give the solutions researching and develop your project of your own thoughts and things so you can think it off uh before log into the session what you should like to do in your future or if you are want to do 
now itself on that so what are the ideas you have planned what are the things you have pre planned to develop your career so that is very very essential for attending this session because research is like that choosing an one title giving a solution to the title is very very important like that title is like your life how you are going to face it the struggles to be there and overcome all the struggles finally your achievement will be there in your date of your life cycle so that like we are going to choose our domains and you can come across all sort of things to be there in our life cycle what are the current trends applications how we are going to developing our ideas and implementing these software either what type of engineering or science whatever it may be we can go ahead and try the platforms where we can implement our idea and develop our expectations so these are the basic areas to be the artificial machine learning deep learning blockchains like that we have multiple neural networks based e-commerce the especially the commerce people you are logging with e-commerce because now nowadays all the grocery items whatever it may be it, it will be never hand itself because we have a small app just you can click up on it and you can order it and it will be reach your house how it will be happen it's totally based upon the what a person like he be it will be did by it olden days so these are the basic platforms we can choose and we can simplify our requirement and we can give the output for our futures okay so what ai do nowadays you can come across artificial intelligence solutions have a consecutive progress by machines particularly by the computer systems that you have come across some paisa orders and other things there is a robot will be there it will given supply of foods cleaning of the tables all the things will be controlled by our system that will be get implemented the research has been done and it will be implemented at the computer systems so like that each and every application in machine level learning that our ai will be play vital role in machine learning also it will give that come across that 2.0 films also that we have learn lot of things how today's current trend current emerging world how it will be go ahead and go ahead how we are going to achieve all those things so like this we can go ahead and it's how this neural letter how the communication has been happen each and every one system to another system how the communication has been let us how it will be get sharing and like our human being how human that ai and the machine level languages as support ours for deep learning to neural network based or from the larger amount data has been shared from one place to another place for example our server will be in uh, arabian sea or indian ocean but we are sharing all our data put together the world wide so this is applications we have did it for the last few years the blockchain current technology which is developed in multi way this blockchain development has been go set and it will be make a remarkable advancement in this trades and reducing a risk factors and the cost per involving especially for the economic problem this blockchain has played a vital role in today's application point of view each and everything will be interrelated and it will be pointed in a single point all the things has been easily identified just you see blockchain is a shared immutable ledger that records transactions and the tracks are searched across a commercial network see for a single point we can have multiple applications what we are going to have like that for example we can take our chennai metro railway station we can access for all over the india that at the location like that the blockchain has been worked out and it will be get implemented there so next to cloud computing how our waves to be once it will be in track how the rain has come like that the cloud companies are on demand delivery of it sources over the internet pay as you are go basis based upon your requirement it will be developed and it will be get implemented it saves your time and effort as well as expenses three types of the cloud company services will be there software as a service platform as a service infrastructure as a service all the things to be get identified and it will be get updated that is a saas pass and ias so big data nowadays the big data also plays a vital role in the development of companies like tcs 
Vipro, Oracle, in you know, all the places, they are, they are running with the big data application. The definition of big data is that very great parity, which comes with a high volume and high speed. For example, for example, you can take an LTC line. It will be only a signal of positivity and negative. Likewise, within a single wire, we are going to share our data. And also in wireless also, we are going to share the data. Without any disturbances, it will reach our applications. So today's session is also like that only. You people are in Chennai. I am in Chelam. How I am going to interact with today? So this is a big data application. So we are going to share a number of volume of data with the high speed frequency. That is a thing you can go ahead. This data is so large that traditional data processing software can manage that. But the mesh amount of data can solve the business problems that you can not tackle before. In olden days, we are not having such kind of things. You see, we are going to sit in in foreign and we are going to solve the problem in Chennai. How it is due to this kind of recent application will be happen. And also, we have a data mining. Just you can type in the Google, okay, where is Chennai? Immediately it will be shows, it will be resumed that. So how the data to be there? Wherever it will be there, worldwide, but just you can take a Google map, how it will be get find out the ways, okay? How it will be get, the data will be get input in the Google application and it will be shows that, so some designation we are going to enter means defaultly to make a route. So that is a application we are going to find the data it's a big area related database management. Nowadays, a lot of data has been generated and it will be stored in the servers and it will be resumed by where we need that application has been covered. For example, today the bits will be there. Big, big MRCS companies are launching a bits in online itself that you have come across. For example, you can take an BSE that are tradings, shares, distribution, all those things. So there you can find a number of software that is a data mining application has been implemented and it will be get developed day by day and it will grows enormous database applications. Okay. Like that, networking. It is one tool for sharing our data by through internet, that is through wired applications. So these are the things. Networking is exchanging of information ideas between people in the common function of the particular interest, usually by utility social settings. Offering a being a single point of common ground application. Professional user networking expands the circles of opportunities, learn about the jobs, opportunities, multi applications we are going to use this networking. So, under image processing, nowadays, in security point of view, we are using thumb impression, face recognition, all the things we are going to come across it, either by 2D or by 3D. So, these things have played an important role in image processing technique. And that's a type, what I have explained to you is visualization and the recognition. So visualization to the face, we are going to face to face, we are going to see the sensor, it will recognize and it will be applied. Recognition by using a thumb impression, it will detect the data, a security point of view, it will be there. And the sharpening and restructuring create an enhanced image for original image. This sharpening and restoration. For example, if there is an a crime, how this security people, so how they are going to find out that the police station are there, we are going to find out that they can make an images by sharpening and restoration with the original image. So that, that it will be go ahead. For example, uh, for you have the childhood the photo if you have means what is your position now? How you are be there after 15 years? How about your growth? How about your face? It will be a change. All those things you can go ahead. And then pattern recognition. What are the around the objects? How the images will be get patternized. Retrieval, process search images. Older data has been easily Digital image converted and will be get. We have their similar image to be get destroyed there. And then cryptography that you have come across cryptography. It's a method of protecting information and the communication. Up to this, we have come across how to share the data, how to visualize the data, all those things come. Now we are going to speak about how to protect our data in security. So that is the protecting information communication through use of codes. That nowadays we are using a barcode scanner. That you have come across the GPA, Google Pay, all the things will be there. QR code. So the QR code plays a vital role in today's application to sharing our whatever it may be, mobile cost wise or data. If you like to go over read any books, that if you have a QR 
QR code, just you can scan it, the entire book data has been opened. So that is the thing. It is called as cryptography. Technology will play a vital role in today's applications. So these are the technology. What we have lively, we can come across. And we are using this technology. We are going to do an thesis researches that we are going to do. So choosing of an area, how we are going to play important role, how to learn the data sharing between olden days and nowadays, how it will be get transformed from one place to another place, all type of algorithms, all the things, calculations, all the things we can go ahead for doing with the help of this programming. And the internet of the IOTs, today, each and every things will be highly secure. The data will be get monitored and to be get highlighted in each and every things to be there. For example, you can, that you can come across in a college premises as well. Each and every floors, you can find the cameras. In nowadays, the house has been highly secured with internet facilities. IoT has placed a vital role. Opening a door, closing a door, all the people has been highly protected now, nowadays, nowadays. So like that, we are going to go. In application point of the commerce application, e-commerce, electronic commerce is buying and selling up of goods, services, transferring of funds or data, or electronic data, primarily internet. These business transactions do B2B or B2C or C2C or C2B, all type of business activities we can do with the help of e-commerce business strategies. That you, for example, we can take and share, sharing. You don't know, but you are going to invest your fund in some other location that is digital. So the digital application has played a vital role today in business point of the business and e-commerce companies. So based upon this, emerging technologies, what it will be in our hand. By you using these technologies, we are going to implement our golden data to fine tune it and we are going to find a new applications and we are going to submit as a research that you can find an output for this and we are going to control that also. That is a journal that you are going to prepare in your life cycle. Whatever you want should, as a student, you are whatever it may be, you are with UG students or a PG student, you should publish one journal at least of your life cycle span. Why? You? Of your studies time. Because then only you can get to know that what you have learned as a commerce student, what you learn as a science student, what you learn as an engineering student. So that is a thing. Think about money. We are spending our time. Money is also we can easily earn it, but we cannot earn our spend our time by easy. So the thing, I advise you people all, everyone should start writing your journal publications in the year of second year onwards. Because you are in higher studies, you are not in a plus two hand, you are not in a UG level, you are be there. So you people you are going to choose your profession based upon their profession you are working you are learning so what is your aim and scope that you can make it a journal and you can and going to make, make it as a record it's a question sir that you have said that sir make an advantage a paper journal you can publish it what is an advantage what is the use for me that is your big question i think so am i correct yeah so making a journal you are research that your findings will be get authenticated, never it will be copying. Nobody will copy it at all. So this is a remarkable criteria, remarkable things you have made it in your studies point of view. So everyone should have expose your interest through publishing your journals throughout the world. It will be resume wherever you can move. If you are in you are in the states also, you can just type your web, type your title of your paper, you can view there. Lot of advantages. You, it is reviewed by each and every, in each and every day, minimum of 10 members, they are reviewing your data. So what you have did it. So how you are being, how your knowledge has been shared to all other peoples. That is the thing you are going to do with your John side. So how to such paper. How to first learning a target, how to choose a topic, how to write a paper, how to write a thesis, how to check the language. 
So writing a journal is not the easiest work. First of all, you should think it out. Because to do your one thing, or to do your own business, what is the basic criteria we require? What type of business is it? Type of business what you are going to do is first thing. Second thing, what type of business for that, how much fund is required? Who are the clients, those who are going to purchase a particular product? That is the important criteria. What about the market thing? What about the things to be there? So these are the things we are going to learn doing a business like that. You can take on writing a journal. The basic need is that. So what type of, what's the title you are going to opt for that? So what's the title you have given to me now today? The target of higher, find out the higher impact factors of journals. So like that. So my question, my answer is that, which journal is the highest impact factor? Why we are going to say it is the highest impact factor? That is the thing we are opening. Before that, what's the journal? Then only you can know that. What is the highest impact factor the journal will be there? Okay. So how to choose a type topic to find a solutions, find a problem and to find a solutions. So between these two, find a problem and to find a solutions, between these two, there is a lot of experimental work will be there. Our arithmetic calculations will be there. And the formula we are going to use for to bring out the output. So these are the things we are going to make it of. So as a title or as a research paper. To ask to write a mini research paper, you need to learn how to go to write a successful paper in that. So structure of a journal writer. What are the basic structures to be there? For each and everything, it will be get modified. First thing we are going to speak about title of your journal name. That for example, I like to do a journal. I like to prepare a journal in the name of e-commerce. So that you are going to give us some title for that. Yes, case study from Hyundai car, which is in German. Example I will tell. So that is the title. So in the title, you are going to focus upon abstract and introduction, literature, letter to our proposed methodology, what you are going to do. Already there is a car company will be there. They, they did a lot of things to be there. What is you are going to propose in the existing methodology? And you are going to compare those things and you are going to produce the results and discussion and the conclusion, what is your findings to be there in the conclusion. To make this conclusion, how many journals you have find out but to give the conclusion, how many journals you have utilized, you have learned, and you have find supporting data for this that you have find out in this applications. Okay, that is a structure, basic structure to be there. Each and everything we can come across is title of your article is one of the first indicator. It will get your research and concept. It will be consistent accurate. You should include the most relevant keywords in your title, but avoid including abbreviations or formulas. Never should, you can't use any abbreviation. For example, A, B, S. Okay, so don't go ahead. It should be a complete sketch to be there. Okay, and the good title defines the fewest possible words that adequately describe the content of the paper itself. So first thing is very, very important. My, every time I have advised all the guys who are doing a research under my guidance, I ask them to, the title should give the answer for your questions. Title should give answer for all your questions. Like that, you should select the title and keep it. So based upon the title itself, we can move ahead. Okay, that is the thing we are avoiding. For example, you can take books of a commerce-oriented books or engineering-oriented books. A trigonometry, yeah, book will be there for in the mathematical calculations that you have all all the guys who have come across it. So trigonometry, what it will place? That three types of publication we are going it. That is the trigonometry we are going it. Like that, each and every title will give the answer for that particular application. Like, for example, you can take your name itself. So you can ask your father and mother why you have give this name. Some people, some of the fathers and mothers are depends upon uh, gods. That's when they have given a name to the son as a god, Murugan, Sativa, like that. Some people have believed their nature. Based upon that, they have given name to like that. Like that, 
the choosing of a title for a journal is very very important and it will precise the entire structure of the particular title then the good title will define the fewest possible word that is adequate description content of the paper the title is extremely important must choose on the great care it will be read by thousands yeah just you can think it out just your work is there just simply you can post and you are going to publish your paper by sitting on system and you are going to do that but it is reviewed and viewed by millions of millions of people they are going to day by day they are going to view it so if anybody will give past you the sir your title should be very best and you should not be replied one it should not be copied one next indexing and abstracting of the paper depends on the accuracy of the title so what is an indexing that you have come across n number of journals will be the scopus paper is there scopus journal is there sca paper is journal is there uh, anaxia papers is there like the n number of journals to be there so our writing should be more than anaxia one papers scopus papers indexed papers so the indexing and abstracting how it will be valued ranking will be there also how it be come to our journal means totally based upon your title title also plays important role in our indexing point of view so next how abstract should, abstract should maintain how abstract we are going to prepare define a summary of the information about the document it is of the fundamental importance that abstract written clearly and simplify it is first and sometimes should only for the part of manuscript it it should provide a brief summary of the each and the main sections of the paper state the principal objectives and scope of the investigation discuss the methods used summarize the results and state the principal conclusion it is easier to write and abstract after completion of the paper you should be care in that abstract is called thesis entire data for example in tamil there is no one proverb is there oru bona chothukku oru soru padam solvanga that is the abstract of a thesis or abstract of a journal we can find out that this abstract will give all data of your thesis i always i initiate my guys you should never miss abstract and conclusion in a touch manner never you should be in prompt in your writing this because once abstract should be get clear all the for example take our human being if our face should be a very good agathin alaga mugathil nu solli solirpaanga or power blazer nam endha alavuk index is a face <coughs> mind is a index of face like that there is a lot of things we can speak it up here because i am not having a, that much of time i think so uh, <coughs> this happened yes sir yes sir so so it will be able and it will be improved And in our side what are the criteria we are following it should not exceed 250 words it should be written in one paragraph it should be written the fast tense one is as it is effort to work done totally based upon the work it may be a singular or a plural or in present tense so that is totally based upon the journal how you are going to writing and the long word should be followed by its abbreviations which would be used throughout the abstract and paper we should you should not cite any references it should never give any information or conclusion that is not stated in the paper must be accurate with respect to the figures quoted in the main text and keywords are essential part of our producing journals that you have come across in the journals after abstract that you can find the keywords so what the keywords has been specified for example the keywords what are the things you are going to use in your journal it will be easily highlighted in that keywords itself okay so that is the thing when writing a journal article you must select a keyword that you would like to your article to rank for but a role will go up by indexing and the ranking of the journal that is important okay help potential readers to discover your article and conduct research using a search engines so at the bottom of the introduction about your journal about your work that we can speak about your work so what type of work is that what we are going to say and 
in olden days how will it be look like now what are the things currently what is there what is going to be happen in the future the things we are going to give us an introduction that we are going to develop it so introduction the pivot for article writing process and introduction of not only they introduce your topic your stays on the topic but your argument in the border of academic in the field <coughs> we can have some suggestions or rules regulations should be there to maintain that good introduction you should present nature scope for problems investigated reviews on the pattern literature state of the method of investigation the present results of the investigation <coughs> state the principle <coughs> conclusions and suggested by the research so these are the basic the rules we are following for our applications to develop it okay so general rules to be this use a present tense when referring to work that has already been published but past tense will referring to our own study use active voice as much as possible avoid lengthy or unfocused reviews of previous research cite pre reviewed scientific literature or scholar scholarly reviews avoid a general reference work such as textbooks define any specialized terms or abbreviations so these are the general rule we are following in writing the abstract and the introduction all those things okay in normally it is done next we are going to come to the methodology in which methodology we are going to propose by using algorithm or we are going to work with an, some practical application or arithmetic logical program we are going to do all those things we are going to follow this methodology it should be can be divided to two divisions method is described in one and the subsequent section should be there method is described to this part of the manuscript but must be clear this is some concept so that it can be reproduced also if it is a new all detail must be provided to all the things next we are going to speak about result and discussion the methodology itself come across all the body of the <coughs> entire thesis or other journals to be there that we can go ahead for laterally we can discuss it the result and discussion what we are going to do here we are going to compare what is the existing result with the what the somebody has did it what we have newly find out or in which level we have improved that study or what we have find a new application new parameter in that study all those things will be revealed and it will be discussed and we can give a final conclusion to be in the conclusion so result and discussion may be come under a single section or the presentation separately they may also be broken into subsections with the short and informative headings figure one figure two on the tables all the things should be there in result and discussion to be in the form of new roman numerals and even bring up the sentence also so in the code that heard of the paper need to clear the statement that constitute a new knowledge content to the book the purpose is this section to summarize and illustrate the findings in the orderly logical sequence without interpretations the text should guide the reader through the findings specified that entire research what we have did in the first findings that we are going to have a discussion and finally we can get to the conclusion what we are going to give it so what is a before conclusion method of presenting that how we are going to present the data to be directly the text format we are going to give the table format we are going to present it the figure format we can go with it all the figures and table must be accompanied by the textual presentation of the key findings to be there so tables and figures how it will be look like the figures are appropriate for the data set that exhibit the trends patterns or relations that are best conveyed visually any table or figure must be sufficiently described by its title and captions that in the, in the inside the table we can find the captions or an legend to be understandable without reading the main text of the whole section do not include both table and figure showing the same information okay that is very very essential how to write a discussion it is the hardest section to write because in post in physically uh, we are going to discuss any any things means we have find any number of problems to be there whether he says is correct or mine says is a correct a lot of things to be discussed like that by writing a discussion so the two toughest work first you should frame up and you can evaluate the result then we can go for discussion to there it is a primary purpose to that the relationship among the observed facts it should end with a short summary or conclusion regarding the significance of the work it should be significant to them finally we can come to the conclusion the conclusion reveals all the output of the study 
all the output of the research that is an important factor to be there what are the things you are given the abstract as an output you should be reveal in the conclusion that things very very important bit. okay this should state clearly the main conclusion of research and they give a clear explanation of the important relevance some relation may be a include it is very very essential try to present the principles relationship and analyze those the results point out any exceptions or any lack of correlations in the uncertain points how the results should be interpreted and agree previously published works also to be get highlighted okay discuss a theoretical implementation of your work and any possible practical application to be there you should get mostly the comparative statement what is an existing what is a current that you can easily have it state your conclusion clearly as possible so what is my finding what is your finding what is a thing you are going to conclude that things should be there summarize the evidence of each and every conclusion very very important point what is the in conclusion means you should give the evidence so for example if you take a chemical reaction okay hydrogen plus oxygen says it will be combined automatically water has been generated so like that we should give a conclusion and with an evidence for each and everything that is highlighted in the conclusion and we can move ahead so after giving the conclusion how what are the things you have utilized to frame up this entire journal or a thesis how you are going to get a references and you are going to give a citation to be there what is a self reference and the citations should be balanced current and relevant and that every field is different but you should aim to cite a reference that are more more than 10 years of old if possible studies is related to the research questions so so what is the reference thing one second reference format is very hard to name and yes should system should be there that you have come across come across in that references uh, uh, name of the author and in each, in which year it will be get there in which page it should be there in which line it will be there all the things should be gets that is called as a citation to be very very essential we will go get for writing a thesis or writing a journal that is important criteria to be there because each and every task is important role of a journal to get indexed in highly reputed highly impact packed journals these things will be get kept perfect in your writing automatically don't think don't be lesser that 100% i guaranteed that your journal should get published in high impact and factors journals it will be get as copper journals or a c journals it or it is get 100% indexed journals to be there okay it will be get published okay it is got a hard word format to be there reference list how you are going to give so this reference list should be get for a reference in the reference list we can compare each and every things which is in the body of the content so list allow the readers to in investigate the subject in greater depth reference list contain only the books articles web pages etc and also you can use articles that is also what are the papers you have published that also you can go journals also you can be interpreted that are cited in the text format the bibliography includes all sorts of content background for other readings so these things will be put very very essential things in the reference point of view the key changes at a glance in that references that you have come across et al for what purpose et al if there is a more than two authors or three authors will be there we are going to give et al so for example raghu plus et al so with raghu we have plenty of members to be there we have so up to 20 authors cited in the reference list give the show names and initial up to 20 authors website names should be as well as for example if you are going to take the references from web, web pages the website name should be get included in that web page as a title publication location where it will be there if you are going to take a give us a reference name the publication name 
which country all those things should be there e book publishers you no longer to need to give the platform platform device for the books but you do not give the publishers a retail form you no longer to need to write a retrieval form but before you are so dois uh, format is same you are also you don't need to write a dui also spelling and capitalization there is a general format ethnic and <coughs> ethnic and racial groups are capitalized minor changes in use of languages and formatting assignments that the mechanic says tables figures graphs and the head, heading levels also to be carefully observed and it will be get go for it okay so citations citations gives a reader opportunity to see where you have got this information that is important things to be there to fit your study based on the source as used learn more about the area research topics of your study the strongest line of the defense against a paragraphs or accusation the act of citation will be give a more supporting for us the citation is a plays an important role while go for for flag checking so next week we are go for it flag is that we are go for when writing a research paper you should you draw on data and information then the source on your own argument in pen hours you could use your source like books or articles or website or films or interviews and so forth don't copy it that if you have any pdf there in your software in the ms word format don't copy it that is very very essential part while developing a journal or a thesis whatever it may be you can go through that and you can remodify your entire data based upon your title of your thesis or a journal okay so that is important you should follow in our publications so it enables reader recognize the journals to be there all the things to be get highlighted because it demonstrate that you are citing reliable source support your ideas it gives your paper greater credibility so wherever you can move the citation will help you more and more for your references for the references and anybody else refers us also it will be more helpful for us okay so after making of the journals all those things uh, after make came to night so these are the procedures to develop a journal to make a journal so how to select a journal for publication how to select a journal for publication that is important so first thing we are going to speak about highly impactful factors for the journals we want to select it and uh, selection of journal is an important criteria totally based upon the area of your scope in which scope you have developed your journals whether the scope should get match for that particular journal that is also important factors and how many journal has been published in the per month basis and how many per pre viewed papers journals to be there so all the factors to be get identified and then you can log into that particular journal which is affordable for your writings and of your title that is important criteria that you have offered it very very essential you see author writes author chooses a journal for publication author submit to the journal the journal editor send to the reviewers the reviewer having a following comments pre review first they have got a peer review that in the peer review what are the things has been uh, do it by about knowledge they have check it out methods they have check it out logical parameters they have go ahead to come across it and formulas and identifications of the figures tables all each and everything scope is very very essential for writing a journal that is important what you are going to give us a conclusion that is also the things after all the things has been come across the finally the manuscript has been accepted after from the revisions finally go for for publications this is the process this is the procedure for journal publications and the selecting of journal is very very essential for each and every things there is a lot lot of journal should be there the paid journal will be there open access journals will be there and the journals also the work platform the journal will be get modified and will be fine okay so that we can we can go on so types of journals will be there academic journals will be there trade journals will be there current affairs will be magazines we can go on and the popular magazines we can go on all the things we can follow go on
we can speak about the inductive journals are they considered to be a higher scientific quality as a, compared to non inductive for this slide that much of quality you are going to maintain means for citation is very very essential and also we are going for the following of the steps methodology all the things all the things even to grammar and also plagiarism all the things they have considered that for indexing the journals to be there so and also in which journal you are going to publish that journal how journal papers has been published for a year what about the impact factor they are considering all the things will be get formulated for this index of journals so these are the things we are going to discuss in the next type of index journals will be google scholars to be there scopus pubmed ibas embas dorgis ais indexing ca journals will be there for indexed publication point of view okay scopus index journals to be there elsewhere science direct like that of this is standardized journals will be there which is get published within 8 months 9 months once we are going to log into the paper within 5 to 6 days itself you can get that reply from them whether the journal is eligible for to publish in this particular journal or not all the things has been highlighted that so within 5 days we can conclude after the 5 days our paper is not get any review progress automatically the journal has been moved to the next level to the editors editor chief for all the purpose has been finally and finally it will go for it for publication all those things has come up so basically this elsewhere size role plays a vital role while we are going to publish this papers in this kind of publishers it never remove from the list us also whether it is an anaxer or it is maybe a scopus uh, scopus index itself ACA journals, whatever it may be, the percentage of <coughs> removal is very less compared to other normal stream journals. Okay, the citation will be of more ten thousand, seventy millions, and other sorts embedded in this corpus databases. They are be strong with their application. Three root journals to be there. And the impact of factors we can space that it will be used for measuring and. journal bulk in number of times selected article which is get cited in the last few years okay for example if i take the international journal of commerce and type it is for the period of three years standing lively it will go ahead at minimum of as per the norms of the journal publication the pap journal has been published that is for a month there is a two two issues will be there continuously for a year 24 issue has been committed and 200 journal pip journals has been published means it is 100% impact factor high impact factor journal to be there if the journal which is having published per month at 10 20 30 like that papers means the impact factor is very 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 less compared to this high impact factor so that is the thing we are going to discuss in this impact factors so you see 10 plus how many number of journals to be there what about the rank 1.9 percentage should be the top most rank for the journals it, it is at 10 plus impact factors the impact factors that you have now very well in that lot of criteria we are going to follow and we are going to opt it okay so up to 10 impact factor will be there 0 to 10 will be there so how these things will be get highlighted and it will be giving the rank for all sort of journals we are following that okay then good impact factors by for 10 or higher is a considered remarkable three is a good now our score is less than one so these are the things we are going to do in the application journals are good impact factors are frequently used to indicate the important journals to you if it is commonly used to evaluate the relative importance of journals within the field and measure the frequency which is a average article journal has been cited at a particular time period so these things has been plays important role in there what is a good impact for a journal the journal is the same average impact factor is a depends upon the field of science or journal average varies from category to category but the more according to the same database down to 80 some to of this 4000 journals cross impact factor have been high between 0 to 10 and so this is the average things to be there what is the role of the journal impact factors and the peers journal impact factor is measure the number of times the average article get published in the previous two years and especially in the particular science journals was cited in the given year 
Consequently, high impact apparent journals are usually considered more prestigious than low impact journals. It is more important to understand that the impact factor does not measure the impact of individual article, but also that of journal. So we can think it out. The impact impact factor is a criteria that it will not affect the individual journal, but article it will affect the entire journal history. The impact. Back to should be placed. Okay, so these are the things criteria. How this score has been calculated? So based upon the citation, all the things has been calculated. The impact score also denoted as a general impact score of an academic journal is a measure of the yearly average number of citation to the recent article published in the journal. So it is based upon this focus data only. It will be get score has been assigned for this. In particular, how many journals to be the cited and whatever will be there. How the score has been assigned. Okay. Next, we can speak about site score. Scope of site score measures uh, specific journals citation per. It is completely free to use, transparent, alter a metric using the Scopus data. With the site score tracker, you can monitor the given journals performance throughout the year. That is very very important. See the journal rank will be the Scopus and the SCI. And those databases are operated the principle that all citations are created equal. With this matrices, specific journal subjects quality and the reputation directly affect the value of its citations. So that is important in that. It leaves no space for manipulation. The author can raise their SDR, that is journal's ranking by publishing is more than reputed journals to be there. So we have come across up to this. What are the journals? How to write a journal? What are the things? What are the parameters to be there to make a journal? And finally, after writing all the data, articles kept ready for publications. Where? How we are going to publish? What are the basic things we have to publish a journal? In which journal we are going to? Whether it is an international journal or a national journal depends upon where. Data, what you have encrypted in that article, and the scope of that article, all the things will play an important role for publication point of view. So, in the publications, there is a quarter one, Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4, like that of journals to be there. This stuff come, publishers are there. So, they are well versed in journal publications, yet to be there. Okay. So, process for publication, moving idea to the manuscript. What happens? So the thing what you have think think in your mind has been converted into a text format, and we are going to submit for publication now. In the mid gap between that only, we are going to look it off about the citations and also plagiarism and the procedures for writing up journals. All those things we come across it. And here we break the process into series of steps. This will make this essential task for a manageable. Determine the author. Here we are going to speak about the author. When designing a research project, we recommend preparing an initial list and order of the authors. That is important criteria. After writing a journal, the topmost first page, the front page, we are going to first we are going to write our title. Below the title, we are going to input our author details. Who is a research scholar? Who is the first author? Next to the guide will be the second author, and who are the coordinate authors to be there? All the things will be get added as a three, four, five, six like that. And don't forget to include your designation where you are working. All the locations to be encrypted with the pin code. That is very very essential. And mail ID is also a very very essential parameter when making a journal for publication point of view. And the other thing is that important. What is the mail ID that you have in, <laughs> introduced in that article should maintain for long life? You should be the it is a mail ID you are going to given for the journals also. So such a list of authors should be based upon guidelines. Should make a contribution to each other things. Start writing before experiments are complete. Start writing while you are still doing the experiments. After the, all the things to be get based upon your. Ideas, all those things we are going to do. That we are going to go ahead and publish. 
finally after writing or making a pem <coughs> development of your paper finally you can come for the publish decide to decide is a time to publish time to publish and findings results reference to the complete story whether to make a significant contribution to the scientific research simply collecting the given amount of data not adequate so you see in a publication point of view there is an open access will be there in the open access you no need to spend any money but in paid there is a money to be there that is totally based upon the journals they are collecting a money there is a nominal fee there is a fees enrollment fees will be there so the enrollment fees you are going to pay minimum of 2.5 3 5 10 20 totally based upon the ranking of the journal it will be get paid so that is totally based upon the journals like the big one and also we are majorly concerned upon that communications and also campus methods man how the sex select a journal is a important factor considering when choosing a journal journal should have all the features you are looking for in mind what you are think sir i want to publish this my article in this particular journal alone there is no other option to be a second option is not there these are the things we are going to do it. okay so these things we are going to do so another thing is the languages and also focusing of the purpose these are the criteria for choosing a journals and after choosing the journals we are going to speak about the plagiarism the plagiarism is very very essential for that we are going to don't do cuts and paste from the existing journals just you can come across the data as what existing people has did just you can have that as and convert that as your idea and write a paper journals so how the plagiarism will be get highlighted we will go to check the plagiarism submission 0% the similarity is a quite good 6% is also overall quite good above 10% is go for it lot of journals has been rejected by paper in the publication point of view if it is a 43 percentage it is a average if it is a 58 don't think the journal is the article is going to publish submission 80 percent please don't follow the journal if your uh, article is 100 percent get rejected so these are the similarities where they find out means you can rectify and you can move ahead for submit with the zero similarity because there is a number of softwares will be there for check the plagiarism that is totally based upon this values of submission range so for each and every plagiarism software this value will be get similarity will be get changed because each and every software has been developed based upon of their own because this uh, plagiarism software is also developed by ours only you no know? so how we are going to write a coding so if the continuity of the sentence is like this you should find this is a plagiarism okay if you are going to copy the data from one system ms word by keep opening this a file and you are going to uh, keep that b file to be there just to simply copy from a file to the b file means 100% plagiarism has been highlighted there don't do like that okay so b make your article zero plagiarism so blue will be of no matching test to be there green will be so the protipos percent Yellow, it twenty five to forty nine. Orange, fifty to seventy five. These are the plagiarism report to be get highlighted in your plagiarism. Again, you can reschedule that, and you can by using a Grammarly software, you can check out the Grammarly spelling mistake. All the things you can carry out today's lot of things, lot of software should be there for make your article to be your best one. Okay, so turn in plagiarism scores twenty five percent below that source. Your paper is very original. So normally, don't go ahead for twenty five percent thinking in your mind. you should think about your article should be below 10% it is quite good for to get published in high impact factors journals okay so so th these are the things we have already come across it so good similarity scores will be 0 to 5% is very very good that you can keep in your mind and you write a journals article in such a way that and the international conferences purpose should be there so all the things year by year month by month there is a conferences will be held don't miss to participate in the conferences also to publish your ideas what you like to do what you are going to plan all those things okay so finally we can after public publishing a journals with an high impact factor journals 
we are come to finally have an thesis uh, our we people are guide uh, our students in such a way that make your thesis to be a three part journal 1 journal 2 journal 3 consisting the three journals you can get the thesis like that only i guide all my scholars to follow the rules and regulations of an uh, journals the journals which is in higher end like elsewhere or a science related like that based upon that basement you should write a article that it will be quite good for you to prepare yourself and the journals easily that article should easily get published in highly impact papers okay so these things will be kept in mind and you can follow and you can have it in your future also if you are required just you can contact us wherever you can i am in salem only if you are be want to have uh, some guidance for a research work in which area if you like to go do head it it may be of commerce or it may be of science engineering oriented wherever whatever you want to do that we will guide you in a depth manner we initiate you do by yourself all along with your our support we can do it we are in this field for the 20 years and we will produce a number of scholars researchers that scientist we have developed through our guidances they are well in the well life settled people in abroad also in india also they are working and they are be a well wisher for us they are supporting us in a lot and lot of ways okay thanks for giving this opportunity in this session of giving this uh, target of high risk impact factors okay the online session mostly only little bit i think you have catch it up if there is a physical session means it will be can have some interaction to be there so things we have if we find a time i will be there in person that we have a session also okay thank you thank you for giving this opportunity thank you thank you sir thank you sir if there is any question you can ask sir if there is any question thank you sir it's gives thank an you. immense pleasure to deliver the vote of thanks for this ftp on selection of scholarly journals and web visibility strategies and techniques i would like to thank our chief guest dr as madhishwaran managing director united groups of concern salem for making this session very informative and successful i like to thank our secretary sir professor in charge sir principal sir hod sir for making this opportunity i thank all the faculty members participants coordinators for making this ftp as a grand success last but not the least i thank you all for your cooperation for making this session a resounding success thank you all and the attendance link and feedback link will be send in comment box thank you sir thank you ma'am thank you avura What number is it? Shall I left it, ma'am? Yes, sir. Yes. Yes. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.
Dans 